Happy Monday, Lancers. Today, in celebration of removing these masks, if you choose to do so, we are having Spirit Week. Today on Monday, you should be wearing neon, tie-dye, or glitter. Hey, Tuesday is Tacky Tourist Day, and I've heard that Mr. Walk can be a pretty tacky tourist. You should check him out on Tuesday. Wednesday is Wacky Hair Day. I done mess your hair all up. Or wear a hat. Hey, you all know what Thursday is. Thursday St. Patrick's Day. So remember to wear shamrocks or something green. St. Patrick's Day is here. Get your green on. Boys and girls, I'm talking to you. If you don't want to get pinched, here's what you do. Put on your green vest and your greenest slacks. Green shirt, green shoes, and a big green hat. St. Patrick's Day is here. Get your green on. Green like a frog. Green like a gurgan. It's good. Friday we're wearing red and black. Make sure to wear red and black to show school spirit. Go Lancers! Hi Lancers! Today I want to talk to you about our three R's. Specifically, respect. And one of the things that plays into respect is the language that we use. For many people, the F word, for example, is disrespectful. It didn't come across in a negative way. Sometimes you might think that you're just using it as fun, or you might be using it outside of school and so forth. But that is something that many people take as disrespectful and vulgar and inappropriate. Particularly when you're out of school, and you're trying to get a job, or you're out in the workforce. That is gonna be a word for many people that is going to be inappropriate. And we can't use that word in certain parts of society. So I encourage you, don't use that word at all. But particularly, if you use it, it can't be at school. That's not something we want to hear at Lincoln Middle School. And it's something to consider for the rest of your life, whether it be college or a career. So please refrain from not only using the F word, but any other derogatory or inappropriate language. Thank you.
Hey Lancers, we are gonna continue to focus on being respectful. This week's character dare is called Keep Calm and Carry On. I want you to be aware of your emotions, your attitude, and your behaviors when interacting with others. This week, I want you to work on managing your emotions. Take responsibility for your attitude, behavior, and emotions. We don't always get what we want when we want it, but we are responsible for how we react and behave when we are unhappy or upset. Take time to think about your attitude. Identify if you are in a good mood or a not so good mood and think about how that is affecting your behavior and actions towards others. Maybe you need to take a minute to calm down and reset your attitude so you can have a more positive focus for the rest of your day. It's important to remember that we are responsible for our attitude and our actions throughout the day, even when things don't go our way.